type 1 diabetes is a condition in which the pancreas does not produce insulin, a hormone the body needs to maintain proper blood sugar levels. After having a meal that contains carbohydrates, chemicals in the small intestine break them down into single sugar molecules called glucose. Next, the cells lying in the small intestine absorb the glucose, which passes into the bloodstream. When the blood reaches the pancreas, beta cells inside the pancreas detect the rising glucose levels. The beta cells release insulin into the bloodstream to reduce glucose levels and to keep the blood glucose levels in a healthy range. Most cells of the body have certain receptors on their surface that bind to the circulating insulin. Insulin acts like a key in a lock to open up the cells so that the circulating glucose can get inside the cell. Now, the cells can use the glucose to produce the energy it needs to function properly. In type 1 diabetes mellitus, the pancreatic beta cells lose the ability to produce insulin, resulting in high blood glucose levels and other complications. In this type of diabetes mellitus, the immune system specifically the white blood cells, mistake the pancreatic beta cells for foreign invaders. In an autoimmune response, the white blood cells secrete antibodies that destroy body's beta cells. As a result, the pancreas produces little or no insulin. Without insulin, glucose cannot get into the cells so they are starved for the calories they should be receiving from glucose. In addition, the glucose level built up in the bloodstream resulting in a condition called hyperglycemia. If hyperglycemia is not treated, one can become severely ill because of low or no insulin circulating in blood so the cells cannot use glucose for energy. As a result, the body breaks down fats and protein stores as an alternative source of energy. As fat breakdown continues, certain byproducts known as ketone bodies accumulate in the blood resulting in a condition called ketosis. When ketones build up to dangerously high levels, a life-threatening condition called Diabetes ketoacidosis results because the pancreas no longer produces insulin. Insulin administration is vital to replace what the body should be making. A licensed healthcare professional needs to train clients on how to inject insulin just under the skin. The need to check the levels of glucose in the blood is vital several times a day with a glucometer. To do this, prick the finger with a small needle called a lancet and place a drop of blood in the glucometer.